Yo, yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. What is up, everybody? It's me, Thugget McNugget. And we are back with another cozy stream. Um, hope everyone's doing well. Happy Easter. We are streaming on Easter because not much is going on uh, at my place right now. And honestly, like streaming does help me get out of like the the sunday scaries so uh we are out here we're doing some cozy we got big mike lurking with family right now i appreciate it dog thank you so much let me send you a shouty we got leah in here what up let me send you a shouty as well leah hell yeah i remembered to turn my mix it up on honestly i'm gonna i'm gonna be honest i just turned it on right now i completely forgot until i realized i was gonna send mike a shouty <laughs> i need to get used to it i really need to get used to it um by the way how do i sound yo thank you so much for the head pat i appreciate it we love head pats Hey, Ali, how's it going? Are you actually asleep? <laughs> clever name, clever name. Hope everyone's doing well today. Hope everyone is enjoying their Sunday, their Easter. If you don't celebrate Easter, at least hopefully you're with family, your loved ones, or you know, you're keeping yourself busy. You're doing what you want to do. You're relaxing. You're resting. There's no wrong way to to celebrate just any day. Um, but yeah, we are out here. We're back with Seasons, A Letter to the Future. And uh, it's our cozy game for Sundays. Um, just a little recap. Uh, as, of, uh, as of lately, I'm actually awake. Oh, yo, rebranding? Let's go. Nice, nice. Keeping us on our toes. But yeah, just a little recap of of this game so far is um, it seems like the time on Earth is going to change. Apparently, they're called seasons. And uh, everything's going to change. Everything is probably going to go away or something seems like it, it honestly seems like it, like the end of the world is coming or the end of their world is coming so um our mom sends us on a journey because it seems like we're the only ones who could travel through the outside outside of the town they haven't really explained why too much other than like um other than if you go outside of the town you could get sick uh and it's it's a really bad illness i, ver I honestly kind of forgot what it's called i guess that's how what happens when you uh only stream a game once a week but um anyways what we're doing is recording everything we're going out writing in our notes smelling smells recording in our in our voice recorder sounds uh and you know just getting ready for uh the uh the next the next world they're gonna find our journal and they're gonna know what we were all about apparently so without further ado let's go ahead and continue it's a nice cozy pretty game so it's kind of what i need right now on a sunday <sighs> I'm actually playing on controller now uh, because uh, just this game does seem a lot more of a controller kind of game. Oh, but I do need to change my my controls. Let me see settings. What are these settings? Camera inversion. 
horizontal yeah no not horizontal vertical there we go yeah my brain's actually a little backwards okay so now that uh i'm able to do this voice recorder photography oh you know what i hate i hate it when games oh camera sensitivity no they do they need to do this there's like two inversions and you go and you only find one all right there we go so let's go ahead and take this picture right trigger this valley is asking people for a visit i should oblige it tian valley okay let's if i wanted to run lb all right cool i'm kind of like relearning the game Oh wait, hold on, we could read it. No, wait, I could read it from here. Okay. Historic yet optimistic. How do I take out my journal? Ooh, okay. And then keepsakes. This valley is asking for people to visit. picture right there all right let's continue mm. right trigger there we go Let's give a stop here. Mm. I guess I could take a picture. You never of that. used this kind of technology in my village. Nobody trusted it. Okay. What kind of technology is it again? Electric Peace Project. Oh, it's a dam. Okay. Yo. Forgot how pretty this game is. Even if everything's foggy right now, it still looks very pretty. Just kind of keeping my eyes open for anything. Wait, 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 wait. There's totally something over here. Wait, can I not go over here? Let me go up this cell. But yeah, I hope everyone's having a great Easter. Or a great day in general. Here where I live, the the weather is actually like a little bit like this. A little cloudy. Not foggy, but just like cloudy. A little gloomy. We like gloomy though. We appreciate gloomy. Nothing? Alright. Wait, why is the car? Yo, that's a person. We haven't seen somebody in a while. Oh. Uh, Valen. Um, gather around the gray hand. 
W one second. I think I'm getting a free bunny. So I guess Easter has been pretty cool, lol. <laughs> Yo, that's awesome. How are you getting a free bunny? Is it like a family friend or just somebody who's giving away bunnies? What are you gonna name it? Please respect the residents of Tiang Valley. They are not actors or tourists, guides, or animals, but hardworking folk. Please collect all trash or debris from the con uh, concessionary stands before leaving. This garbage not only clutters the pristine valley, but is offensive to the local people who do not eat mass processed food or drink. Really? I'll think about what kind of visitor I want to be. Is that a Stroto Pop? Uh, what, what are they called? Stroto Pop. What is it? Um, it's a TR-13. I love old gear like that. It's getting more and more rare. I, I had a camera, but it broke. Not that interesting of a story, I guess. What are you doing here? Um, someone local to me is giving away a tiny white bunny. No clue on name. Oh, that's cool. I hope the bunny enjoys its new home. You're gonna take awesome care of it. I know it, Ali. That's awesome. That's exciting. I remember used to having a rabbit back when I was younger, but like super young. It was a real, like honestly, like I was a child. I barely remember. I'm just here to observe and record. I'm here to meet people. Observe and record the world. The whole thing, huh? Mm -hmm. You're young. You you got time. Uh, what kind of stuff are you recording? Hopefully people on their culture, animals and landscapes, whatever catches my interest. People on their culture. Oh yeah. Civilization, they call it. The valley would be a good place to use those tools. Mm -hmm. Too bad it's closed down. Let me finish up here, huh? Is there something else I could look at? The gateway to uh, Tiang. Here stands the gateway to Tiang Valley, home of the three mindful gods. As you enter, try to imagine the millions of pilgrims who passed under the gate before. They were born, they lived, and they died. Okay. I'm not the first to do this. Just the first in a long time. Hey. Aw, oh, man. This was like a second home for a while. That was fun earlier when you showed up. And I was carrying the cardboard man. You were like, who are these guys? Uh -huh. <laughs> I've been pretty bored here. You know, the valley's gonna be flooded soon. That's why nobody can go in there. The dam is falling apart. When is it coming down? couple of days from now. Day zero, we call it. Who's we? Greyhounds. We're a community organization. We do all kinds of fun stuff. Health clinics, mind sweeping, daycare, evacuations, weddings. <laughs> what the fuck? We're new. What is Greyhounds supposed to mean? Quite an election. What is Greyhound supposed to mean? It was supposed to be because we're helpful yet neutral. We mm -hmm. took a vote and decided to change the name, though. We want something more friendly sounding. I'm excited to find out what it will be. We're trying to get new things going. But it's hard. The past really has a tight grip on people. Doesn't feel like a fair fight. So we're trying to, well, anyway. Anyway. It's funny. I stood guard here for a week. 
and I've only seen greyhounds like myself and valley people on their way out. But now I see you, and you're like a new element or something. I have never met anyone doing what you're doing. And uh, we greyhounds got to support you, apparently. So, hmm. I'm not supposed to let anyone in. How can I? Jeez. I think you should go down into the valley and take a look. Got to try something here. Uh, what are we trying here? Dang it. I was trying to wink. <laughs> well, <laughs> you get the idea. Go on and put that old gear to use. You can take my map of the valley, too. I don't need it anymore. I'll be down to pick everyone up around midnight. See you then. I met a greyhound. He let me into the valley. I think he wanted me to record what the greyhounds were up to, and he gave me a map. Mm -hmm. The assembly point seemed like a good place to start. Okay. I wonder what he expects me to discover in the valley. Put that there. Wait, hold on. If I was getting a rabbit, I would name it Bugs. I want a rabbit to name Bugs. We're looking for the assembly. Ooh, pretty. I'd be so scared going down this hill. <laughs> I ran into the grass. All right, let's continue. Welcome to Tiang Valley. Remember, you made it here, but we, we made it here. Okay. My current pets are Mugsby, a cat, Bosley, a frog, Bosley, and Osha, fish. <laughs> so, we'll probably have some silly name. That's cute. I like that. Mugsby, that's a cute name. Bosley, great name for a frog. Osha. Oh, show super aquatic. Ooh, super aquatic. I like it. I am probably the last person that will ever be welcomed here by this sign. Ooh, the map. Where does it say we're at? We're at the bus station. I guess that's, w yeah, I guess that's where we're coming from. Down where that X is. Okay. All above will remain. All below will wash away. Let's, let's take a picture of that. 
OSHA is for OSHA violation because he's a white beta fish. First one I've seen with no colors. Yeah, I assumed also that it was for that reason. That's kind of funny. It's pretty funny. But wow, a white one. Yeah, I've never seen a white one. All above will remain. All below will wash away. The well-trodden... Oh, let me just read this. Oh, the well-trodden path. This very path you stand on has been the same since at least year 350. Imagine millions of pilgrims walking this humble path to visit the famous King Valley Shrine. Why does it keep the saying The elder that? told me there's very little information about the years before 500. Build the ceremony of the random dead. Of the random dead? A person is selected arbitrarily from the graveyard. A monk unearths memories of this person for all to enjoy. I have wondered about the lives beneath unkept graves. Fuck it, let's take a picture of it. There's no record here. Okay. Cool. Okay. Wondered about the lives beneath the kept graves. Uh, let's continue. We'll probably get some cool other memories or something. I'm being a little picky. I don't even think the game really cares too much about what you put in it, but I do. Ooh, 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 ooh. What is that? Like a graveyard? Excuse me, what is a memory flower? Memory flowers are unique to Tiang Valley. Their long history is intertwined with the religious practice of the valley. Stop and listen. You may you might be surprised by what the flowers have to say. Beautiful but dangerous. Remember this. Helpful uh, mnemonic. Memory flowers few. Few. Memory flowers many. Danger or plenty. Memory flowers few. Few. Okay, so it looks like they're a little dangerous when they're. I wonder what the groups. flowers have to say. Whoa. Whoa, what's going on? God of sleep, I've been gathering harpic, and I've been gathering courage. If my big prayer is wrong, if it goes against divine will, Please spare the people of this valley. We're so desperate for peace. Memory told over and over again. That's kind of cool. Man, I kind of wish memory flowers existed. That'd be so cool. A little creepy. But really cool. 
like that. Another memory flower? Yeah. Interesting. Alright, time to get back on my bike. <laughs> what is that? Look at the pond, the water. What is that pattern? Should we run or something? Something frightening happened in this memory. But what was it? Hmm. Hungry eyes and empty stomachs, local artist. These metal animals are looking up expectantly. Let's take a picture of that then. What's that about, bro? Attention, residents of Tiang Valley. Problem, solutions. Blow it up. The dam is falling apart. No one alive knows how to fix it. We'll take the down the dam ourselves. So we will So we will know when it collapses. I see. There's a number to call for questions regarding the dam. Let's pick it up. Why not? There must be a lot of people going to the city if they need to keep track of them with cards. Imagine if the man I met is the only living Greyhand, and the rest are cardboard. Oh, yo, that'd be kind of crazy. Thoughts of an, thoughts on a new season? A manifesto for the future. Everyone knows something is wrong, but nobody knows what to do. Everyone you meet is paddling aimlessly through grief. Everyone you meet is in mourning because the last season left behind a beautiful corpse. It is time to bury it and move on. You say, it's not so simple. Yes, but the walls that surround us are not as thick as they appear. One of these walls may even be a door we will summon a moment of psychosis, a moment of when we forget that we can't walk through walls, and so we will. Uh, oh, and so we, 
we will. We will walk through a wall. What kind of season is on the other side? No one knows because we haven't built it yet. Join us. The gray hands want to end this season. Let's see. Play slide reel. Let's look. say they're going to build the next season how it kind of sounds like they are uh uh it kind of sounds like the new season is going to just erase everything here and it's going to uh i, I guess the gray hand kind of see it like it's like it's starting new and uh, yo we're gonna do better this time like it's a good thing it's a uh, take this the artist has depicted the gray hands as a child they don't have faith in their capabilities but see them as innocent yeah thank you for helping with uh, helping my daughter find her journal. We were so stressed. One of you people named Soul really took the time to answer all my questions my kids had. He was more uh, he was more patient with them than I am. Thank you for helping an old person like me carry all my heavy luggage. I'd like to be a gray hand when I grow up so I can help people. Yo, what? Leah? With a water ASMR? <laughs> you care about my well-being? All right. I appreciate that. I care about your well-being as well. So if you have water, please drink it with me. But uh, here we go. We're going to do water ASMR. If anybody who doesn't like water ASMR uh, don't like it, go ahead and mute. Um, let me see. All right, three, two, one. There you go. Thank you so much for the hydration. I appreciate it. Oh, that was, that was, felt nice. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Rip. I like to be a gray hand when I grow up so I can help people. All right. The gray hand seem to care what people think about them. Well, I mean, it's, yeah, I guess so. Yeah. Low elevation is dangerous. Radiant City is located on high elevation with safe, fertile soil. The elder also said low places are dangerous. This city is high up like my village. Maybe it is safer. A blank canvas for your dreams, a community for the full human being, not the worker, not the parent, not the child, the full human being. It's hard to imagine something new, a new way of living, but they're trying. Yeah, yeah. They're trying to see a silver lining, dude. They're like, hey, this is going to happen. Let's uh, let's just get ready for it, dude. Let's, instead of worrying and panicking, 
Whoa. What the hell? For some reason, I thought that was a... A, a redemption. Who's calling? I hear distant music. Running towards the phone. Knocking things over. They pick up oh, the phone. Thank God someone is still down there. I've been trying to get a hold of someone for hours. Ah, oh, thank you. I forgot the day zero materials. You know, the visual literature, the, the, the warm bath of ideas? I left it at the dig site. It should be sitting on a barrel with a fruit sticker on it. Oh, wait. Hold on. I forgot to do the secret password. I don't even know who you are. Is it too late now, you think? Sure, let's do it. <laughs> okay. What day is the day after tomorrow? Day zero. Phew. Okay. I did figure you'd be... Sorry, I didn't recognize your voice. Hard to keep track of all the new recruits. What else was I going to say? There was vandalism on a few of the posters. Bad stuff. I put them in the trash. Keep an eye out for more. Anyways, thanks for answering. The day zero material is in the dig site, pretty sure. It should be sitting on a barrel that has a fruit sticker on it. You know, I guess I was going to say you could bring it to me. But the flood will destroy it anyway. So actually, huh, I was worried for nothing. Everything is lost in a flood. God, we really know what we're doing. I'm excited for this all to be over. I'm excited for this all to begin. Bye-bye now. Strange, strange. But I wanted to take a picture of this. Felt like it was something important. All right. Take a picture of this payphone. <laughs> What's up, Leah? How are you? How's your day going? Uppies? You want uppies? Yo, that's what, uh, that is totally what that Sylveon looks like she's doing. She's wanting some uppies. That is so funny. I should change it. I should rename it to uppies. That's funny. <laughs> then you could use it. <laughs> no. <laughs> I cannot. I cannot do that. That's too funny, though. I'm feeling hungry. Like, I don't know. People already use that emote as a maze. Parking lot, shrine entrance, fruit farm, cemetery, dam, serene pond. I think, I think, uh, Mike should have an uppies emote. 
Get an Uffy's emote. <laughs> oh my god. It's just like a baby. A baby reaching out. Get an Uffy's emote. Yo, what the hell? Cow? Is that your name on your collar? Let's see. You are Madrigal. Madrigal. What a nice name. Hold on, let me take a picture of you, Magical. What a cute cow. We're gonna add Magical to the journal. Oh, oh, oh. Craving attention. What a day's craving attention. Oh, wait a second. Mm. The process of taking people out of the valley was also a kind of ritual, a way of bridging one life to another. They know the world they're leaving. The next one hasn't been created yet. Okay, also, let me do this one. You found a new thigh emote? Oh no. <laughs> I'm scared to see what you found. <laughs> Even the thigh, the thigh emote that I have was like a little risque for me. But I have seen a few. Little filter. I'm gonna use a little filter for this one. This machine looks powerful. It must have done the work of many people. Wait, where's my uh cow? And you are Mata. What up, Mata? You'll get it when you see it later. I'm scared. And your name <laughs> is Tupet. I wonder who named you that. Tupet. That's a cute name. Tupet. That is what I'm doing. Tupet. Wait, where's my where's my bike, bro? Where's my bike, bro? Did you eat my bike? Oh, I left it down there, didn't I? Uh, oh well, whatever. Should I na should I check the all the cows? You are a cow, and you are named Krasnahorkai. Krasnahorkai. Damn, that is a lot of letters in one name. Oh, really? Okay, game. Hmm. They're being evacuated. They're moving us into an apartment building in the Radiant City. There's no room for animals. It breaks my heart, but I have to tell you, I have to leave you all here. I've got the radio tuned to your favorite station. You've always done right by me. These people had to leave so much behind. Shut up, right? Oh, we got a big show today. Huge show. Breaking news. The Greyhands have died. What? 
are being reborn, baby. And we're taking suggestions for our new name. Live, on the air, suggestions from the rank and file. You don't even need to be a gray hand to suggest a name. True, true. The number to call is 0019. That is 0019. First caller, hit us with a name. Uh, hi, yeah. I was thinking the bricklayers. Okay. Bricklayers. Laying some bricks. Hmm. Well, yeah, th uh, thanks for the suggestion. We'll be taking them all Fucking afternoon, so, so keep them coming. That number again is 0019. You're listening to Grey Hand Radio. <laughs> we are broadcasting live from Grey Hand HQ. And we're going to take a little break. I love if the that. Grey Hands are changing their name, you'd know them as something else. Sounds like it comes from somewhere far away. It makes me want to keep traveling. Hmm. What is this here? Best move? Cow champion's best move. Oh, that's cute. Cows from all over the world came here to compete in cow stuff. The golden season seems like such a different world. Some detailed embroidery from the cow festival. It'd be nice to learn more about this. A beautiful cow named Gorp. Gorp. Compared to my village, they lived in the open here. They lived on the land itself. I hope in the future, at least some people are still living like that. The name of this cow is TVC15, oh my. TVC15, oh yeah, let's go. What a nice name. And the seventh cow's name was Balto. Balto? Yo, Balto? Who remembers that movie named Balto? About a wolf. Uh... Delivering a medicine with a sled, and they were like, He ain't no sled dog, that's a wolf. And Balto's like, I'm better than all these wolves, bruh. Come on. Or can I not go over here? The cow is called Frenzy. All right, okay. Uh, I think I should have brought my bike. Now I have to run all the way back. Oh, graffiti, ah, oh, not on this person's. 
not in the house. This gray hand kid just wants to be loved. Yeah. That's what it looks like. Yo, what the hell? How did this cow get up here, dude? Another cow, another perfect name. <laughs> Nelly. Nelly. Okay, Nelly's a nice name for a cow. Also an R&B singer. Hmm. Yeah, this game is relaxing. How do I check my map? Oh, there we go. Okay. Uh, should styling in the open since the, okay, where am I? Where am I? All right, I'm like around. I was about to point on my on my on my monitor, just be like, oh, I'm over here. Farm surrounding. Where's the big sign? Looks like there's no one around anymore to enforce this. Is this the big site? Is this the big site? Do you or someone you know suffers from daytime visions? I wish Pate could call this hotline to talk about his heavy dream. Alright, we're at the grave site. At the dig site. These signs are so demanding. I can't imagine them in my village. It's so demanding. There are a lot of these signs. They must really want to keep people out of this area. I see we're super cozy today. Dude, yes, we are, bro. We are cozy today. How's it going, Nav? How are you? Sundays are now cozy days because... I found a dick site. I do like these kind of games. I like... What were they doing here? I like games that you just kind of like take a step back, relax. Not too much gameplay. Uh... I guess like you could say like indie indie games that are like just trying to tell a story. So that's what I'm trying to emulate here. Yo, thank you for the head pat nab. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You want some of my drink, bro? It's like tea. You can have some if you want, bro. A gray hand said he left his materials behind. How you doing, dude? How's your it should be somewhere around How's your here. Sunday? How's Easter going? The day we packed the last crate, we were sweaty and exhausted, and Jono says, the real work begins after day zero. Ha ha ha. Damn. They look relieved to have finished their work. OK. 
tambourine. Uh, I'm doing good since we're busy and I'm just grinding Final Fantasy 14 PvP and chilling. Dude, that's cool. That's cool. I actually need to jump on Final Fantasy 14 today as well. I want to get that uh, Easter, that Easter, uh, what's it called? Event finished. I want to do that before it ends. Get like a Tomberry uh, outfit, which is actually pretty cool. Just chilling as a Tomberry. And then uh, you also, I, I um, Cheens and I, we said that we were gonna do uh, Tower of Babel. That's where we. That's where we're at in the story. So, uh, yeah, dude. I f honestly, I feel really bad about how I'm treating Final Fantasy XIV, because like before every expansion, I would like go through the story and everything. But with this one, and especially, it's not the last expansion. I f I feel, but it's it's the one that wraps up the story. Um, I'm just kind of like treating it whatever and I feel bad about it even though it was like super hype uh, Yeah, Tomberry outfit got it on a few alts too That's cool. That's cool Yo, what's good nugget? Yo venom. How are you dude? Thank you so much for coming out. How's your Sunday going? Yo big Mike No, dude. Thank you, bro. Thank you How's it going? There's a big tree with a researcher's notebook inside it somewhere. We are doing Sunday cozy games, as you could tell. I am good. It's been good. Did some Easter egg hunting. Got some new uh, dress shirts and bow ties. Oh, hell yeah, Venom. Let's go, dude. Look, gonna look fresh, bro. I get that. I've been on break from 14 after finishing the story, trying to get back into it. That's cool. That's cool. Getting ready for the new uh, expansion or the new uh, updates or something. Sunday's going well. Uh, felt. Sun okay, so Sundays, as I always talk about this, Sundays always make me feel a little like meh. So um, I'm trying to do streaming during Sundays and uh, like just cozy, relaxing games just to get my mind off that, you know, tomorrow's the work week. The work week starts tomorrow. So that's what we're doing here. It's like low energy coziness, enjoying just a nice game. Not bad, tired from yesterday. <laughs> Dude, I bet. Did you drink a lot? I am a bow tie enjoyer. Nice. I used to wear ties, dude. I used to wear ties, man. I was that weird kid that wore ties in, in high school. Not like a suit, but just like randomly wear a tie. I was, I was really weird sometimes in high school. I don't know how I had friends, but I did. And I don't know how I never was bullied. I'm thankful that I wasn't. Um, but, uh, <laughs> yeah, I was definitely, like, I could see myself as, like, a little bit of a weirdo back in the day. I didn't really see it as that. I just saw it as myself, like, doing what I wanted to do and shit. I just smashed my elbow into the door. Holy crap, dude. This you is all right? the kind of brain trouble my mom warned me about. Dude, Glass, thank you, thank you. How's it going, Glass? How are you? We are cozy today, dog. Distinguished. Better than other teens. Yeah, yeah. We're, we were distinguished. I wear button-ups, but just like... Not really like dress up but button ups, but just button ups. Dude, I'm sorry. Hope you feel better. Ooh, I wanna check that out. I wonder what's on this reel. We're gonna find out. What is day zero? We already know what day zero is, dude. Come on. You already know what this is. Yeah, we're gonna find out. Maybe I can find out more about it. 
Hold on, you should already know what day zero is. It's the day the dam goes down. Big prayer, day zero. Are they planning to perform some sort of prayer on day zero? Okay, a picture. You want a picture? We got it. We're gonna take a picture. Yo, by the way, we have reached one hour into the stream. I want to thank everybody who's come out, said what's up, and has done their thing. I really appreciate it, guys. I really appreciate the company and the support. Guys are awesome. Dude, what is this? Is that like a potion thing? I've recreated the same setup as the prayer statues right here in my workshop. I set up a singing bowl so I can verify the pattern that will form in the a water. Singing bowl. And some harping, of course. Each god seems to correspond to a resonating frequency. And when this vibration acts on the harpic, we get the um, psychoactive response. Going to give it a try here. Then... Oh. Are we, see, are we gonna see a memory? I remember watching my dad make shadow puppets on the wall. It felt strange because I could see how it was done. Sign your boobs, what? I could see the trick of it, but it still felt kind of magical. <laughs> it worked. I do feel the more I do this, the more tired and... Uh, it feels like it takes me longer to return to the present. But now I have some control. I face the question of how this mineral affects the soil. I still have a lot of work to do. That's all for today. A mineral that can affect the mind. A mineral that can affect the mind, bruh. Whoa, says Glass. Dude. I should handle this with care. Who knows what kind of mind trouble it can cause. Mind trouble? Let's take a picture of it. Fuck it. We got that, that item, right? Oh, uh, well, I, th I think we did. See, we there's other things that we need here. What is the dig site for? What is day zero? Okay, let's go back to our bike.
guys give me one second i'll be right back sorry about that i'm just gonna hit up the restroom real quick Yo, what's up? I'm back. No, I just went to the restroom real quick. Uh, Venom. Sorry about that, dude. Let me see. Big trees, researchers, and all that stuff. Okay. <laughs> you're good, you're good. We're just enjoying this nice, pretty game. Have any of y'all ever heard of it? It's called uh, Season... Uh, oh wait, I haven't checked this place out yet. It's called Season. Oh fuck, I crashed into this place. Uh, season: A Letter to the Future. It's kind of a trippy game, honestly. It's a little. Uh, I think it's trying to tell us something. It's like a personal story, maybe, like from the creator. But it's about this person who's uh, going around, uh, note, keep writing notes, recording things about or uh, about their home and everything oh okay this is actually bad right this is actually protecting me apparently apparently um a new season is coming it's not too sure what a new season means but it kind of seems like everything's gonna get wiped out people's memories are gonna go away or something so, um, my character's job is to go out and record everything and, uh, just bring it back, bring it back to the people. This field was absolutely full of memories. I'm glad I had my pendant, otherwise it would have been overwhelming. Can I walk through it? It's a radical concept. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's kind of melancholy in a way. Slips. 
I'd like to read my favorite book again without knowing what happens. I know it's tedious, but if you, give, if you could remove my memories of it, I would I give an offering of supreme loveliness. Dude, I I would love that. If I could forget Majora's Mask and replay that game without knowing anything about it, holy crap, dude. I would I would fucking love that so much. There's a lot of things that I would love to play again without knowing. My memories of the war, I don't need them anymore. I don't. They're yours. What I saw by the light of the moon, that pattern in the water, I want to forget it. What I saw in the light of the moon, that pattern in the water, I want to forget it. Yo, Hoodman, how are you, dude? These slips are prayers to this god for forgetting things. Yeah. It's kind of crazy, in a way. It's going nice, it's going cozy, you know. We cozying it up right now. Dude, how was your stream? People prayed here. Who did they pray to? Am I very quiet? Has anybody said anything? No one said how quiet I am. That's weird. Yesterday, we did have somebody say that I was quiet. Um, Pat actually said that I was quiet. And I was messing with the volume levels of the uh, of the mic. And I, um, I didn't like how it picked up everything. So I'm trying to be a little quiet. I never mentioned that. I assume my audio was reduced greatly on Twitch. Yo! <laughs> Guys, wow. <laughs> That's so funny. No, nah, it's all good. Let me fix that. Hold on. Yeah, you're quieter than normal. I am, well, I, I am like just a little like, I am a little quiet, but the mic is not supposed to be quiet. So let me fix that. Properties. Listening. So 30 is a little too low. What about now? Testing, testing. One, two, three. Dude, everyone thought I was just being cozy. It's just like, yo. I'm just being a little cozy right now. That's so funny. Well, now y'all have to help me. All right, still really quiet. Okay. How about now? Testing, testing. One, two, three. We are testing. Testing, testing. Hello, hello, testing. Nope. Still really quiet? All right, all right. Doesn't seem to have changed. Okay, okay, I think I know what it is. I think I know what it is. Hello, hello, testing, one, two, three, can you hear me? How do I sound now? Maybe the slide is better. Hello, hello, testing, testing, can you hear me? How do I sound now? All right, I actually went downwards to see if you've noticed that. Testing, testing. Oh man, this is messing with my eyes. Better, better, okay. 
All right. Um, this is kind of like how I had it yesterday. Do you think that's that's fine? Okay, let's see. Let's add the game music. Okay, how do I sound now? We did just get a new uh, microphone. It could be louder. It could be louder if you can make it. Okay. We just got a new microphone, so we're still kind of like playing with the audio levels. Um, let me see. Okay, how about now? Testing, testing. Testing, testing, one, two, three. Testing, testing, one, two, three. How do I sound now? Better, okay. All right. If this is better, then we'll just leave it like that. Okay. Thank you for the help. Thank you. Yo, Connor, how are you? Oh, shit. Did I forget this? I got you, dude. Thank you. Thank you so much. The Connor, Sir Connor. How are you? In Cairo, we have a statue to remember Dr. Fumio. Nice. Big Mike cheering. Big Mike games. But this statue is meant to be worshipped. By the way. Sending out a shout out to the HUD man, to the nav man, to the glass man, and again to the mic man. Let's go. Y'all, we just posted a bunch of uh a bunch of shout outs. Let's go. Go check each other out. All y'all are awesome streamers, awesome people. Loving the Snarlax Snuggie, dude. Thank you. It was actually given to me by a uh, new friend, Akitas. She is awesome. I always, I always like considered uh, getting one, but I didn't really know how to use one. And then when she gave me, when she gave it to me, I was like, you know what? It's time. It's McFreaking time, y'all. I'm still jamming out to yesterday. <laughs> to yesterday's song. Dude, that was all y'all, dude. That inspiration came from all y'all. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Um, no. We are trying to bring out our journal. I'm trying to get to the damn it. Turn page. I got a Muriel command in Huddle's channel. What's a Muriel command? That's funny. Uh, okay, so. A Muriel command. That is too funny. It says, Muriel, where's my dinner? <laughs> too much macaroni. Not enough cheese. Too much cheese. Take a picture of that. And we can take a picture of this. Did I love that episode? Hmm. Yeah, what's that crystal? Hmm. 
that what that's supposed to be? There's something beautiful about the way the minerals catch the light. That oh yeah, that pig that owns the burger joint? Yeah. I know what you mean, dude. I know what you mean. Ah, damn it. I'm pressing the wrong buttons. All right. Mm, what? Terrible. People prayed at. Um, isn't that what I'm, I got or something or the grab one and take it, select the slip for my journal. Okay. There you go. I like that one. The coolest character is cats with his rap music playing in the background. And he enters the scene. Oh, yeah, yeah. Wait, the red one, right? It's like a red cat. You know which which one I really like? Um, which episode I really liked? I really like the... Uh, what's it called? The episode where they um, turn... When they, they get turned into, like, appliances. Like, Muriel turns into a washing machine. And Eustace turns into a crane. Courage turns himself into a helicopter to like get him out of there. Or get Muriel out of there. Dude. What am I supposed to... I thought I was supposed to like... Put something here. New inspiration. This is a season when memories echo on and on and on and on. Will the echoes fade away or will they be cut off abruptly? Yo, can we uh, get a water for Mike, please? Bro, your water will be right out, dude. Right out. Hell yeah. Uh, Eustace goes mad and starts breaking shit. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, it's supposed to go there. Hmm. Wait, 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 wait. I think I just supposed to like put something here. And then that. Greyhands are the future in all its uncertainty, the good and the bad, the hope and fear of progress. <laughs> nice, dude. Redeem the, the first. The loneliness of this season will be left behind. A collective project is coming. The elder warned me about valleys. She said they were dangerous. I feel a dulcet tension in the air. I enter to see the moment between seasons. Miniature with the... Oh yeah, I remember that. I remember <laughs> that, dude. <laughs> I remember that. That was... um. It was an episode where uh, they're running tests on them or something like um, I think m who's like they they start making Muriel grow hair and they're like uh, shaving it off of her or something. 
Yo, thank you for the head pat, dude. Or I don't, I think I remember that. Right? And he's just going through, like, rooms looking for her. And he runs into that girl just, like, super scary. I think I, yeah, I think I remember that, that scene. My, uh, I think you already know which one I think is, like, the scariest. The scariest one for me is Return to Slab. Just something about that, like, 3D. That, like, really crude 3D. And, uh... And return the slab. You know? Like, oh, it was it was scary for me. I didn't... I loved that episode, and I was like... I was like, alright, I'm a, I'm about to get scared. Hell yeah. Yeah, return the slab. The green space. Dude, uh, return I feel the slab, memory dude, episode. Air like pollen. Is in the top three it reminds me of for a me. poem yeah, my dad was real. never able to finish. The first line was, "If you want to awaken the dead." <laughs> weird, whisper. realistic moon man face. Yeah, yeah. Dude, um, another one is with the um, the the um, the duck that thinks Muriel's its mom. He's like, Mama! Mama! That one's, that one's actually a little, like, sad. I wanted to say that one was, like, sad for me. The realistic face is the scariest to me. We should watch some on Discord. Dude, that would be badass. We definitely should. One of these days. No. No, no, no. I want to feel safe to play. No. What is that ceremonial bowl where people prayed at? Is it that I need to like take a picture of this or? Or am I recording it? Nothing. Okay. I don't understand. So these flowers have the ability to, or the, not ability, but these flowers bring up voices and memories of people who have passed away. So there's many flowers and that's why we could hear many memories with people talking to us. Oh, the guy with the blonde hair that has a huge smile and crooked teeth. Oh, dude, that's Muriel's nephew. Dude, okay, that that episode was a little like the, when I got older and I rewatched that episode, like, dude, that was a little a little disturbing dude i don't want to say it don't say the word but that dude was was something something bad and uh i'm i know it's a kid show and shit but like yo that was bad oh let's go the end mirror's edge game is on xbox fast i never played mirror's edge Good evening, everyone. Yo, Potato, what is up, dude? How are you? Hope you're doing well. I'm trying to find a picture here. Yo, thank you for the lurk, dog. I need to add uh, a lurk command again. Or I already have the lurk command, right? But I need to uh, 
change it up. Make it a little bit more uh, Thugged McNugget. I'm good, man. How's you? How's the game treating you? It's it's going good. Today is uh, Cozy Sundays. So um, this is like our cozy game selected. Um, it's called Season, A Letter to the Future. Indie game where uh, you are somebody re uh, recording uh recording things recording sounds recording smells recording images with pictures because uh it seems like the earth is going to go away or there's going to be a big change and people are might i think people are going to forget what's going on and uh yeah so that's our job uh today sundays are usually like I definitely get the Sunday scaries, honestly. I get them. And uh, and streaming helps me, so kinda helps me get through it. So it's good. It's it's going good. Uh, and it's weird. Have you have, do you guys ever just feel like the anxiety of uh, of the work week coming? But like as soon as Monday hits, you're just like all right, I'm good. I'm fine. I'm good to go. And Sunday is supposed to be like the your day of rest, but it really just it's just depressing. You know? That's how I get it on Sundays. Like I my motivation is just gone. But uh, you know, we out here. Yeah, most definitely. I don't know what it is, man. I really don't know what it is. It's Because even, like, after I... And, like, before I started working and everything, I would still feel like... Oh, what the hell? I would still feel like, oh, Sunday, you know... I treated it like a family day. Like, I didn't want to do anything that day. That is such a weird... Hold on, hold on, hold on a second. We can record this on. Whatever is making that sound, I'm glad they sealed this shut. Yo, what the fuck? <laughs> what is that noise? Yo, monkey? Hey, yo. I'm sure these critters will escape the valley before the flood. Come on over here. Over here, monkey. I hear ya. I feel, I still feel that way despite not working. Yeah, yeah. Thanks for understanding. Dude, this monkey, man. It's just a feeling that just will not shake off. Oh man, that's so pretty. Yo, goats? You're a future person. Are there goats where you are? I think I hated Sundays worse when I had to go to school versus work. I get that, yeah. Because, like, work is just a routine. While school, while it's routine, it also introduces, like, yo, I, uh, I got to finish. I, you have deadlines also, but, like, every day, almost every day you have a deadline at school. You had homework. You had grades. Yeah, that anxiety of like doing good in school. 
failing a class and shit like that. There are a lot more possibilities here for gardening. The soil must be rich. In oh. Rhubarb is one of my favorite words. Rhubarb. 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 <laughs> the text is barely legible. Three aphorisms from the young. If music is complete, then it is not music. It looks like a set of aphorisms. Aphor now to find the rest. Hmm. All right. All right. Let's see. I'm not a morning bean, dude. Same, same. Oh wait, morning. Mm, no, you know what? I I take that back. I like mornings. Something about mornings to me is just like I don't know, like it just puts you in a good mood. I think it it does. I think waking up in the morning and seeing like the sunrise it does something to you psychologically where it's like, you know, you're starting the day. That's what that's what I believe. I'm not sure if that's true or anything, but it's definitely some something that I feel um when i wake up and i see the sunrise hey there happy easter yo wicked wolf gamer yo what's up how are you how are you doing happy easter to you too how'd you find my stream but yeah um i used to back in the day i used to like wake up at around two in the morning two in the afternoon and we'll go to sleep at like 5 a.m all the time and it was just so like uh it, it wasn't it wasn't good it wasn't a good time for me i know it's not not everybody feels that way but uh i definitely felt like it was like messing with me a little bit but uh, whenever I wake up in the morning, it's just such a nice, like, it's nice. I don't know. I don't know what to say, how to say it. I'm good. Just chilling. That's awesome. I'm glad. I'm glad you're chilling. Did you do anything today? Did you do any egg hunting? Did you have family come over? Did you eat? Did you have a cookout? Did you have candy? Did you have chocolate? <laughs> Fuck, I really want chocolate. You know what I want? I want a solid chocolate uh solid chocolate rabbit that's what i really want uh i feel you some people are morning beans some are noc nocturnal beans yeah some people just do better at night man yeah 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 but uh guys i think that's gonna be the end of this stream uh we are going to be uh, we are going to be uh, closing it out. I don't remember, but I followed you. What? Really? Nice. You came out as a first time chatter, so I really appreciate it. Uh, what was I playing when you followed me? I might come back later on today. It really depends. Um, but I do have plans uh, for a little bit later. So I have to get ready for that. So, yeah. But I do appreciate everybody who came out and said what's up. It was definitely cozy. I'm so sorry about my mic being uh, fairly low. So, uh, uh, yeah. I uh, I really appreciate y'all helping me out with my mic issues. Again, we just got a new microphone. So, uh, working on it. I'm, I'm, I've been working on it, doing things to it. I'm saying what works, what doesn't, and still learning uh, the settings. So, um, 
Yeah, there's probably going to be more times when I mess up. <laughs> uh, oh, okay, take care. Yo, Wicked Wolf, thank you so much for coming out. Um, tomorrow, I'm not going to be streaming. So, uh, yeah, I hope everyone has a great day tomorrow. But I'll be back on Tuesday. Uh, we're going to be going ahead and we might do uh, Resident Evil 6 with Mochi. We might continue that, hopefully. And we might finish the Shelly and Jake sequence of that game hopefully we do and then i could start on ada wong's sequence of the game and i hear that single player so uh i could definitely do that by myself and finally be done with resident evil 6 holy crap guys imagine being done with resident evil 6 holy shit right yo by the way i am so sorry original potato head let me give you a shouty go get, uh go check out original potato head awesome dude very supportive does uh not models fuck figures does figures paints them paints figures have a great night yo no thank you dude thank you um and let's see let's go ahead and raid out real quick but yeah, we're going to be doing, Res hopefully we do Resident Evil 6 with Mochi. If there's, if everything goes well, we're going to be doing that. Uh, let's go ahead and raid out to. Yo. Friend of the channel, The Gaming Wraith UK. Let's go ahead and raid out to him. Give me one moment while I set up this this the gaming wraith uk good friend awesome person the gaming wraith uk there we go we got it all right have a great night yo big mike thank you dude thank you thank you miniatures that's the word i keep forgetting dude i'm so sorry but yeah i hope everyone has a great rest of your night and i'll see you tuesday for another stream i'll talk to y'all later adios bye bye